what is your fear? And I'm getting over mine. And this is how I did it. I have a huge fear of recording in public. My chest caves in. I start breathing heavy. I start getting the nervous sweats. Basically, my anxiety is kicking in. But as someone who's trying to pursue content creation full time, I need to get over that. Attention please. Please do not smoke in the terminal building. Smoking is only permitted in the specified smoking areas. Thank you. So, um, it is 4.35 a.m. now, so I just got to the airport, went through TSA and all that stuff. And it's funny because, like, this whole video, honestly, is actually me, like, trying to get over my fear of recording in public. So that's why I booked a trip to L.A. for the day, and I'm just going to record me doing stuff and sort of just, like, getting over my fear of, like, recording in general so like right now i'm actually getting stared down but i got my music in you know i'm chilling um so there is actually a great person um, well i never met him but as a youtuber i actually watch a lot too he his name his name is kelly wakasa and he says do what excites so basically that's what i'm doing right now so i book like a sporadic last minute ticket to la and i'm gonna travel there for the day so other than that um Let's get it. The camera. Well, they can't hear you, but it's it's because you're in my my ears. But you could say something, and I'll just like go over it. Well, I could say what you're saying. He likes toes. Just letting you know. He likes toes. Okay, okay, okay. I'm just gonna cut you off. All right. I finally made it to Little Tokyo or LA. Um, it's probably like the most sporadic thing I've ever done, but this is actually in my mic stack. But this is actually like a way to get over my fear of recording in public. So I'm here at Little Tokyo. I just rented a car and it's pretty sick. Uh, everything's closed right now for the most part and I'm mad hungry. So other than that, and I'm mad tired, I need to look for random coffee shops or something because I am dying. So anyway, I shall catch y'all in a little bit once I find a coffee shop. And I'm mad awkward too. So basically the whole point of my, me doing all this stuff is actually uh, I'm getting my fear of being on camera. So basically, head to Venice, probably finish my day off there, go back to the airport, call it a day, and eat. I still need to eat because I haven't ate yet. So I think it's about to be around 11-ish, I think, not too sure, but it's low-key fun though. So I'm actually, it's low-key hot though. Like, I'm, like, from, I'm from Vegas, Vegas it's but it's still hot. hot. So hopefully the wind's not too bad just because it's I'm on the corner of this building and 
It's pretty windy, but I actually got really tired and I started just like roaming around. I actually met up with a friend who lives in Boynton Park and we actually got some food and actually caught up for a little bit. So I was insanely tired, so I stopped filming whatever just because I just needed coffee and whatnot. Um, but to sort of reiterate this whole message thing is like um, be comfortable with the uncomfortable because there's times where you're going to need to push through that and sort of get to the point where you want to be in life. So like, for example, for me, it was getting the fear of recording in public while people are in front of me, like right now. So um, I honestly realized that it's not as bad as I thought it was. You sort of just got to put yourself out there. So if you are trying to do something and you're sort of just uncomfortable with it, maybe just take a leap forward, you know, or take one step forward and that's it. Um, you just never know until you try. There's more to this video and some of my clips are actually going to be like, some of my clips are actually going to be um, muted because um, sometimes my mics didn't pick up and they died. So yeah. So now this is going to be a bunch of B-roll and stuff and I'm going to be doing more quality content rather than short term. I'm still going to try to give you guys the short term content as well, but I'm trying to focus on my quality content and so you guys can know more about me. Uh, too. Yeah, there's my whole basketball stuff, but there's more to life than just basketball. So hopefully you guys can join, you guys can join me within like my travels and whatnot and when I go to Japan in October and stuff like that. So there's more traveling, more like I guess you could say conceptual video, uh, conceptual videos or just some like stuff I have had on my chest. So it's like life vlogs or life content. So I hope you guys are good. Um, if you guys need anything, don't be afraid to comment down below if you're going to do something. Um, obviously, I can't fly down to where y'all are at, but uh, definitely if you're going to do something, use my videos as like a way to sort of like, I guess you could say, have a bubble so where you could be protected and stuff like that. You know what I'm talking about? Like your safe zone, I guess. Use my videos as a safe zone if you want to. If not, you know, we're all good. But my last statement is that... Don't be don't be comfortable with the don't be so comfortable. Be comfortable with the uncomfortable and just do it, you know? Like these guys are looking at me, but I don't really care if I'm uncomfortable. Because now I could fucking watch everybody and film like this while they look at me. So yeah, that's how you get over your biggest fear. Is actually just diving into it and taking little steps. Cool.